Alleluia. Christ is risen. The Lord is risen indeed. Alleluia. That joyful proclamation means we have made it to Easter. Yet another trip around the sun. Another year. We made it to Easter, which if I could leave you with one message today, it would be this. That Easter is a season, not a day. And thanks to what Jesus did for us all, for what our God did and does through Christ, it's Easter for us every day. With the coming of Easter Day, our Lenten fast is ended. Perhaps for you that means you can indulge in something wonderful, something you have denied yourself in this Lent now past. Maybe chocolate or soda or dessert, something decadent and almost forbidden that you've given up for these last 40 days. Our self-denial is supposed to give us on this day and this season just a little bit of the taste of heaven, a glimpse of the resurrection life when we have all that is good and want for nothing. The idea of self-denial came about for lots of reasons. Some would say it was an economic one, helping us all see we could and should live with less. Kind of like fish on Fridays, which a lot of us think was started because there was a fishing industry and a bit of trouble. However it started, I think it's not all bad to change, to give up, or to take on. What shifts like this in our life truly do is help us to maybe, just maybe, honor and appreciate the things we do have a bit more. And if we're really fortunate and the blinders fall, we see the people around us, even if we are people that think we're pretty unlovable, or unnoticed. Sometimes when we loosen up on a few things we possess so tightly in this life, it makes space for us to see blessings we miss that we don't have room for otherwise. I hope you've gotten some of that experience in this Lent and that this Easter season makes that all the more apparent. My wish for you in this Easter season is that you fully know the blessedness of eternity which doesn't begin some other day, but is yours today and always. That is why we say Alleluia. May you be blessed in the hope and joy which we are given through our life in the risen Christ. Blessings to each and every one of you.